All right, come on here, Fuzzy. The Varner family has a baby alpaca called Acrea, born two days ago. Okay. But their little girl is getting off on the wrong foot. She has a very wobbly leg, and we're curious whether it's the knee or the hip. Yes. Their greatest fear is that the newborn's stilted gait is irreparable. Always hope for the best, so hopefully Doc has some insight on it. So this is what? Watch your walk. That's very wobbly. That's the knee. This one was just a gangly young Kriya. It looked like all the joints were still disjointed Come almost. On. Come on, you little fella. Mm. Oh, yes, Mom. I got her. That's my grasses. <laughs> <laughs> you spit, I spit. <laughs> oh, well, don't easy. Flip her over. Pick it up. Pick it up. There you go. She drops in the hock, see that? Yep. Yeah. And that is because the tendons on the front are too loose. Everything is in place. There is, there is a little bit more space in the hip because she's not using it. Okay. So there's no muscle there. It all will tighten up. But let's give her a dose of selenium. OK. When they're born like this, sometimes they don't have enough selenium. And selenium is a very important mineral. With the vitamin E, it's used to keep muscles healthy and strong. What's the dose for her? Like 18 pounds. Uh, those 18 pounds, I, I would give her one cc. Give him some time. Sometimes it takes a couple of weeks for these animals to get going, and then suddenly they take off. OK. Oh, 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 oh. The baby alpaca will require some time on its own to recover. We'll probably go back and keep this one isolated with the other babies and mothers. Okay. Hopefully it'll strengthen up, and then we can put the whole herd back together. <laughs> 